Hello, hello, how are you? I almost would call this not from this physical world because I followed my intuition, which that's what I always advocate. Follow your heart. Follow your higher wisdom. Interesting what happened to me yesterday. Now that we almost are facing 2018 and that's the universal year number 11, so it's two ones from 2017 as a universal year number one. So beginnings, beginnings, beginnings. And yesterday I was already making a video for my patrons. Uh, the link is down below. This basically because sometimes you're asking what is Patreon. Uh, mine is a little different. You not necessarily go there just to donate something, but um, I have two channels. Level 333 and 1111 for those who want to learn about the new energy, about what's going on now, how to be successful, how to think, what counts, what doesn't count. So it's profound, especially now that we're going to the universal year number 11 and January 1st, 1 1, right? So I'm making this video and I'm done. I go to press the end on the video camera and there is nothing, it's dark and I cannot do anything. Nothing was recorded, which is <laughs> shocking and I'm saying, okay, it's got to be a message if the memory card is okay and I see the battery is okay. I'm trying everything and the only result I get is the sign error, error, file error, error. I can say okay. Um, I know the memory card is empty, everything is okay, so it's some sign, right? That's what I call following your intuition, okay? Reading the sign. So I just relaxed my mind. I started to watch, uh, I think, my new uh, movie that I got myself for Christmas, Close Encounters by Steven Spielberg, about Mom Shasta. So I'm uh, watching this and I love the movie and suddenly I hear, go to your other memory card because you have a spare one, which I never used. I knew what it is. But what is on that card? Anything. So I go to the card, I put in my uh, camera, I connect to my computer, and I cannot believe I have hours of pictures, videos that I never posted on YouTube. And what was very characteristic was year 2010. So it's two years before the new energy kicked in. I was uh, on Maui, Hawaii for my birthday and waiting for my son and tsunami coming to Maui, although thank God never uh, got there. And as I'm watching this, I'm realizing that this was my personal year number one. So that's important. What happened in the year when we're starting something and everything was beautiful. I was for the first time on Maui. I enjoy so much Hawaii. I call Maui my second home, if not the first one. I absolutely had the best year of 2010. So I'm going through other videos and what happened? After nine hours working, 
and um, there is so much noise outside that's why I'm stopping but in this case uh, it was a good noise everything was happy the music uh, I was happy um, it was going great and I was becoming the new me. I started to use uh, a video camera. I was in beautiful places um, because Hawaii, after all, is a paradise. So I stepped in. I stepped in into heaven, heaven's doors. And that's what was going on for all these years. So 2018 for me will be a personal year number nine. So endings, completion, but also very spiritual, the lessons that I learned. Uh, so a very meaningful year. Uh, and uh, what happened and why I'm telling you this, after watching and copying on my computer, downloading and uploading to YouTube some things, I experienced a shift. And no wonder it was already after midnight, because it's already, and was 1.11, and we're talking 29 is 11, and we're going towards this January 1st, all once, okay? So it's like a gateway. Where are you going for light or are you going into dark? Um, our choice. And I'm like, oh my God. And shift happened just like that. With what I got up in the morning, thinking about certain things and people, and what I was after midnight thinking and feeling, was completely different. That's how it happened. Boom! Because 11 means shift, literally. So, watch what you're thinking, watch what you're doing, starting um, already, but especially January 1st. You may experience exactly the same thing. As you're watching me right now, say, yeah, Grace, but I know how I know, how I feel about that person or that situation. I know how I suffered, I know how hurt I got. <laughs> oh, uh, it may just change. And if the love and compassion takes over in that change, and love is the only thing that is worth something, okay? This only one thing that is real. Everything else is illusion you may go through a profound shift in your own life which from the bottom of my heart i really wish you the best year ever wonderful 2018 when love compassion and inner peace balance harmony will create peace on earth many kisses Many hugs <laughs> and until the very next time.